So I've got some food I need to put in the barrels. I also have some I need to take out. This is what I use for storage, um, long-term items, uh, uh, rice, flour, sugar, honey, uh, tea, coffee. I'm gonna put 50 pounds of rice, 50 pounds of flour, and I forget, uh, some beans I have I need to put in here. The barrels are uh, cabled to this tree. And that's to keep the bears from rolling them off and turning them into play toys. It's happened before, so to keep that from happening, uh, you need to chain them or cable them to a tree. Another uh, negative 20 day today. Lots of wind. I think the temperature's like negative five right now. Gust to 20 mile an hour, so it's it's about negative 20 something with the wind chill. You can definitely feel it. It's not one of those days that you want to spend a, a lot of time outside, but. I have no choice. I, I need to get more wood for the winter. Oh, 50 pounds of bread flour and I got a 50 pound bag of rice and this is a uh, this is about 20 pounds of uh, bread flour. It used to be a 50 pound bag. I have oatmeal, beans, uh, crackers and granola, and baking soda, baking powder, uh, vinegar. All kinds of things are in these barrels, but mostly stuff like flour and uh, rice, uh, beans, those are the, the three big ones, sugar, honey. Next time I come out, I'll put another 50 pounds of uh, flour and rice in here. I got room for for that. It's a good idea to get stocked up. 
Also need to bring out a lot of frozen vegetables for the winter. I plan on planting a garden in the spring. We'll see how that goes. I need to automate that garden because uh, I work for a month at a time and then I'm only home for a month. So it needs to be able to water itself. The high tunnel is going to have an automatic fan in it so it doesn't get too hot and it will automatically water. It will have to have a solar system on it. And also the perimeter of the uh, high tunnel and the garden, the outside garden, will need to be fenced in with an electric fence. So I'll have a small solar system set up down there also. I've been keeping food in here for almost eight years now and I haven't had any problems at all with uh, any types of bugs or anything like that. No squirrelage. They're pretty airtight after you uh, seal the lids up. So I'm going to try to find a, a nut for this. I'm tired of, uh, of messing with this uh, wing nut. Go down to the workshop and see what I can find. So I need to get two more uh, barrels out here. That'll give me a pretty substantial amount of reserve foods. This is already quite a bit. It'll probably last me over a year with what I got here. Oh, my God. 